Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Mr. Super Tech So. In my channel, you will be learning some new skills from Malay language and English language. Without wasting much time, let's go! Hi everyone, today Mr. So is going to guide you to write an essay or we say to write paragraphs based on the pictures given. So the title of the essay today is, yes, a lady who met a naughty monkey. So have you seen monkeys before? Yes, okay, especially the wild monkeys, they are very naughty. So do you want to know more about the story? Let's go. So, first of all, we must look at the instruction, okay, given. So, usually when, uh, before you start doing your essay, you must read the instruction first, so that uh, you can get some basic information from the, of, uh, from the instruction. Uh, for example, uh, the name of the character, okay, the place and so on. Sometimes, they may be mentioned in the instruction. So, if we were to look at here, okay, um, there are no extra information given, but you still need to comprehend it before you write out your essay. Write a story based on the picture below. You may use the words given to help you write your story in the space provided. Okay, let's look at the pictures. So, as usual, here we have three pictures. So the question can be set uh, in one picture, okay, two pictures, three pictures, or four pictures or more, right? So there is no fixed numbers of pictures, okay, stated, right? So let's get here. In the first picture, as you can see, there are four characters, two adults and two kids, right? One boy and one girl. So what are they doing? Okay, you must be very clear of what they are doing, right? They are hiking, they are jungle trekking. Okay, so make your mind clear. So let's look at the second picture here. Okay, yes, the female here, I would say this is a mother because as we can see in the first picture, okay, they are one family and this is a mother, right? So what happened to the mother? Okay, yes, where is her handbag? So what happened to her handbag? Yes, there is a monkey on the branch with a handbag. It means, okay, the monkey has snatched her handbag again. Yes, has snatched as an A T C H E D. Okay, the monkey has snatched her handbag away. So remember, handbag is written in one word. Okay, H A N D B A G, and they are joined. So, okay. How did the lady solve her problem? Okay, when your handbag is snatched away, usually what would you do? Yes, okay, you will scream, right? If you cannot retrieve it, you must scream for help. Okay, let's get here. The lady screamed for help and later, okay, there are some brave men, sorry, there were some brave men who helped her to retrieve her handbag. Not her husband here because the husband had to take care of his children, right? So now there are two men here, okay? They were very brave and they helped the lady to retrieve her handbag, right? So this is a happy ending story, okay? Usually the, the, the story given, okay, will be ended happily. So please, okay, write based on the pictures given, Okay, uh, you don't write, you don't create your own story writing that uh, the handbag of the lady was snatched away and the monkey took it away and never gave the lady back her handbag. This is wrong, right? So you have to look at the picture and write as what is given. So let's get the words given here. Number one, hiking. Okay. You hike up the mountain, okay, or in other words, some of you will say, okay, when you travel up the mountain, you will say you climb up the mountain. Okay, usually we don't uh, write uh, climb up, but we'll write hike up, all right? Scenery, they enjoy uh, looking at the scenery or they enjoy the scenery a lot, okay? 
now fresh air usually when you go into the jungle yes the air is very fresh so walk past it means okay the lady was passing by a place and there was a monkey and the monkey okay without her uh, uh, is out of her expectation okay or she was not aware of the monkey so the monkey grabbed her handbag away right so the lady at that time she screamed for help and then um the hiker spotted the monkey and they helped her to retrieve her handbag and then the lady thanked the brave man that's all okay this is the story so now how are we going to write our paragraphs okay number one okay you must know what do you want to tell in the first paragraph what do you want to tell in the second paragraph as well as the third paragraph it's very important right so let's get the first paragraph okay i will be talking about okay the hiking journey okay the hiking trip so during the last school holiday okay her family here her refers to the lady so madam tan and her family went hiking in the mountains okay so we will go hiking in the mountains it means the area is quite big and you are traveling you are hiking within that area okay so the sentence would be during the last school holiday madam tan and her family went hiking in the mountains so along the journey okay they were mesmerized by the breathtaking scenery around them okay mesmerized mean it means you were attracted okay uh, you were attracted by what okay the breathtaking scenery it means the beautiful scenery around you right so along the journey they were mesmerized by the breathtaking scenery around them so they enjoyed the fresh air okay so uh, when you go into the mountain when you go into the jungle you feel that yeah Okay, you feel extra fresh because uh, the air is fresh, right? Uh, maybe there is a lot of oxygen or anything, all right? So they enjoyed the fresh air while looking at some unique insects in the woods, okay? While looking at some unique insects in the woods. Woods here refers to the jungle. So in the first paragraph itself, we write only, okay, the hiking tree and what did they see and how did they enjoy themselves right so let's go to the second paragraph so for the second paragraph we will be talking about the incident of the monkey grabbing her handbag away so out of the blue okay someone grabbed okay madam tan's handbag away okay when she was walking past a tall tree okay so out of the blue someone here we write someone because we don't know who was that usually only person okay only people will grab your things away right i cannot write here something okay if you write uh something here it sounds gloomy it sounds uh, cring right so now out of the blue someone grabbed madam tan's handbag away when she was walking past a tall tree she was shot out of her blue ah sorry she was shot out of her wits okay sorry she was shot out of her wits it means she was completely shot right so she looked up okay so you can write uh, without hesitation she she looked up and found it was a naughty monkey okay so at that time she looked up and found it was a naughty monkey okay so now okay she knew okay the monkey had grabbed her handbag away then she immediately screamed for help because she could not reach the monkey okay she immediately screamed for help because she could not reach the monkey okay as well as her handbag right so now she was helpless at that moment okay helpless it means she could not do anything so the second paragraph itself we are talking about the whole incident of the monkey grabbing her handbag away so now let's look at the third paragraph okay so at that time okay some hikers spotted the monkey was running away madam uh was running away with madam tan's handbag okay at that time some hikers spotted the monkey okay was running away with 
came Madam Tan's handbag. They chased after it and successfully got the handbag back. Okay, they chased after it and successfully got the handbag back. B A C K back. All right. So Madam Tan thanked the man or the hikers profusely for the help. Okay. And she could finally heave a sigh of relief. Heave a sigh of relief means she was completely relieved at that time. Okay, she was no longer worrying about her handbag. Okay, so Madam Tan thanked the hikers profusely for the help, and she could finally heave a sigh of relief. Right, so. Uh, it was an action-packed day of fun for the entire family. Okay, an action-packed day. It means it was an eventful day of fun. All right, it was an eventful day. Okay, it means many things happen in the same day, but it's happy. Right, so it was an action-packed day of fun for the entire family. So that's all uh, for my sharing. If you have any questions, please type in the comment space or you can message me privately. Okay, that's all from me. Bye. If you like my channel after watching my videos, don't forget to subscribe and like my video. That's all for today. Bye.